And finally this week, a London challenge, finding an affordable night out in one of the world's most expensive cities. Not easy, but we sent Lindsay Woods out to give it a go. And this is what she came back with. A Wednesday evening in central London, and what I've been told is a great night out. People down in the basement of a pub playing what I thought was an old instrument, the ukulele. So this is Ukulele Wednesday. It's people of all ages. It has the power to bring people of all backgrounds together. When I first came, I knew how to drink beer. And so the first few weeks, all, all I did was play C whenever I saw it, and that's it. I'm definitely going to need some lessons. Lorraine Bell organizes the weekly ukulele get-together. Let's see what she can teach me. Now, I don't have to be that good for Ukulele Wednesday, do I? No. Okay, so where do I get started? So we're going to start with the A minor chord. Okay. So you're going to pop your middle finger just at the okay. top there. And we'll do eight down-ups on this okay. just to get us going. And then we're going to do eight Cs. Okay. Put your third finger there. One, two. Uh-oh. You've got really good rhythm. And you've got an really? E effect. Yeah, yeah, really good. Oh. Picking up the basics of the ukulele is actually pretty easy. Four strings, four fingers, and strum. And it's cheap, too. Mine costs about the same as going out for a couple of pizzas and a bottle of wine. After an hour, I'm beginning to get the hang of it. I started to play in 2007. I gave up smoking and then replaced one habit with another. Wow. So, yeah. So how much better do I have to be to go to Ukulele Wednesday? You can come next week if you practice all the chords I've shown you. Going down. One great thing about learning the ukulele is that it's so small you can practice just about anywhere. So after a few days strumming, it's time to put it to the test. Back in the basement of that pub. I'll admit, it's way more fun than I expected. <laughs> There's a real joy to playing music with other people. And nobody minds if you don't quite know all the chords. It feels like a community almost, as corny as that might sound. But it's nice, you come in and people aren't judging you for how good you are, even though there's some like amazing people. Everyone's really lovely, and it's a really good bunch. And I feel like maybe it invites a certain type of person, and they're nice and they're friendly. Three ukulele Wednesdays around London, and plenty of ukulele festivals. And when I return home to California, I'm tempted to look out for something like this back in LA. I'm just gonna shake, shake, shake.